For our next example, let's take a look at a model that integrates everything we've learned in the module together into a single structure. We're going to look at how we can create a parametric structure that has some placement points to place both adaptive components and adaptive panels. So we'll start by basically defining some geometric control curves. We'll replace one of those curves with a little bit of a sine wave, then compute some rib and panel placement points, and finally place some rib and panel components. So just to give you an example of where we're going, if you take a look at this image, you can sort of see a little parametric structure. It's kind of a linear structure that hunches over, and what we've done is basically placed a number of rib components as well as panel components between those ribs. So let's go ahead and take a look at how you could go through and build this example yourself.